what's up for those who are new to my channel my name is Ashley and today I have a tutorial for you guys on this look that I am wearing I did film just the eye parts if you guys are interested in knowing what I put on my face make sure to check out the description box so let's get started for my base I'm going to use max paint Pot and paint Julie. and I'm gonna apply this just all over the eyes and I'm just using a real techniques brush I'm going to grab Salted Caramel from the Too Faced Chocolate Bar with my BR250 brush. So I'm going to apply this as my transition color above the crease. And this is my Coastal Sense BR250 brush. So I'm just going to blend that in. Ronaldo, don't start making noise. And I'm going to do circuit motions going back and forth as well. Same brush, same palette, I'm going to grab milk chocolate and I'm going to kind of put it on the crease, not so much over the transition color, but then I'm also going to grab some more and I'm going to be doing kind of like a halo effect or a sandwich effect, however it is you guys like to call it, but I'm basically going to put this all over the eye to make sure that everything is nice and blended. In the inner corner of the eye, well not in the inner inner corner of the eye, but like in the inner part of the eye, the outer part of the eye, just to warm it up for the little bit of the, for the, for the darker color that's going to be there. I'm so nice, yeah. Same brush, same palette, I'm going to grab semi-sweet. With this color, I'm going to focus it on the outer part of the eye, the inner part of the eye, and a little bit in the center so, so that it can like be well blended. With an eyeshadow brush like this one, I'm going to apply this individual eyeshadow from Anastasia in Gem. And I'm going to apply that in the center. You see that space that I have right there? I'm sorry if I'm looking down and I have my mirror down here. But I'm just going to apply that right there in the center. Just pack it on. To intensify that, I just spray some Fix Plus over that eyelid color. And I'm just going to tap it on. I'm just going to make it pop like a little bit metallic-y. And then we're going to blend that. So back with the Coastal Sense brush, I'm just going to go ahead and blend the edges of it so there won't be any harsh lines. Ronaldo! And then a little bit on the top. And then a little bit over here. So I'm not trying to bring it out this way. I'm trying to leave it more like in the middle. So on the inner corner of the eye I'm going to apply Inglot Sparkling Dust just to kind of give it a little pop right there. Just like that. I'm going to apply a black eyeliner on my waterline. A small eyeshadow brush like this one. This is the Morphe M506. I grabbed Semi Sweet, the same color we used to do the um, outer part of the eye, the inner part of the eye, the whole sandwich effect. And I'm just going to blend the lower lashes. I'm going to try to get the black eyeliner and that together and just... Go back and forth and then a little bit of circular motions to really blend that out. Now I went a little bit dramatic, just a little bit. <laughs> but um, if you have small eyes, you don't want to go as dramatic. Since I do kind of have bigger eyes, I can pull it off. It can work out. And if you have big eyes, you can pull it off if you want to. But to kind of just top this off, I'm going to use this Maybelline. I've been obsessed with this one. You guys know that I've been using it a lot. But this Maybelline eyeliner in uh, Striking Copper. And I'm just going to put this on my waterline. And then I'll curl my lashes and put on some falsies. I'm so in love with you. So this is the final 
look. I hope you guys like this look. If you did, make sure to hit those thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you guys can be updated with all my new videos. Make sure to comment down below. And make sure to follow my Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Periscope, all that goody good stuff. Because I am a social media addict. Not something to be proud of, but oh well. So make sure to follow me there if you haven't already. And then I did this new thing that I want to do with you guys. So I created an email account for this YouTube channel. I want you guys to send me your questions there or anything you guys want because I suck at checking my, my inbox on here. I recently did it and I had like messages that were years old and well, I didn't know how to check my inbox so don't judge me. But I know sometimes you guys want to send me things and you guys don't want other people to see it. So I created this account for that reason for you guys to, you know send me your stuff and we can interact and and whatnot and i also want to start this thing with my roommates this is exciting because i love to film my roommates you guys love seeing my roommates in my videos as well so we want to do this thing where you guys send us questions it can be about your relationship it could be about life it could be about anything really and we're going to make a video specifically about that question and then you have three different people with three different perspectives we might agree we might disagree or whatever and i think it's going to be really fun to film a video like that all of us together. I think you guys are excited because I'm super excited about that. So make sure to send us your questions so we can get on it. And um, yeah, thank you so, so, so much for watching. Make sure to check out the description. Did I say thank you so much for watching? I mean, thank you so much for watching. Oh my God, it's Spanglish. But yes, make sure to check out the description box. It's going to have all the details on the makeup that I put on my face. And, uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I keep saying that shit. Oh, my God. I'll see you guys next time.